Now, Godzilla, speaking of animals, uh, holds the Guinness World Record for the longest-running movie franchise in history. The fictional monster has been around since 1954. And next week, he's back on the big screen in the most expensive instalment yet. Showbiz editor Nelson Aspen went on the set of Godzilla 2, King of the Monsters, Nelson High, giant-scale production. Uh, what did you see? Yeah, $300 million. I've been dying to show you this for two years. That's how long ago I, I filmed this, because that's how long it's taken for them to get the CGI absolutely right to make one of the most visually stunning epics you've ever seen. Take a look. Our planet will perish, oh God, and so will we. Unless we set Godzilla free. This time we join him. He was once our biggest threat. Now he's the one who can save us all. My God. Zilla. Godzilla 2, King of the Monsters, is a sequel to the 2014 blockbuster and the 35th film in the global Godzilla franchise. Man, this is every movie lover's dream come true. I'm in Atlanta, Georgia, on the set of Godzilla 2. It is spectacular. It's like nothing I've ever seen, and I've seen a lot, as you know. It's been two years since filming began here, but a movie this size needs ample time to ensure it delivers on the big screen. Are, are you having fun with this at all? Or are we, are, can no. We, no, not at no, all. No, it's not fun. <laughs> it's dangerous. No, it's, 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 it is a challenge. It's a big challenge. It's physically... It's physically challenging. It's it's fun. It's fun to play with the other actors. It's it's the job. Cold, wet water all day long. You're bouncing around inside of a Humvee, and you uh, <laughs> you do what you can. But it's a uh, it's you know it's very rewarding at the end of the day when everyone comes together and you get what you do as actors, and it's and you get to see it on the big screen. Kyle Chandler leads the all-star human cast with Millie Bobby Brown from Stranger Things playing his daughter. It's uh, dark but it has a light humor to it. It's very, very chaotic. Um, the beginning is very calm, and in the end it's very chaotic and crazy. And uh, it's just a really, you know, biting in the nails, an edge of seat movie. Co-star Vera Farmiga says the new movie tests our preconceptions about the classic monster. It's too black and white to think of Godzilla as a hero or a villain because he is a representative of nature. He is nature's wrath. And Mother Nature isn't good or evil, she just is. Godzilla 2 is heavy on special effects, a challenge for actors like O'Shea Jackson Jr., who on set were reacting to a monster, of course, that wasn't really there. Okay, so the camera is Godzilla. It's kind of a constipated look, you know, more of a like a. This is it. You know, think about your loved ones, because right. it's time. Now, you usually have to pay for that. <laughs> <laughs> this is God's in this world. We just live in it. Damn right. Godzilla 2, King of the Monsters, <laughs> comes out in cinemas next Thursday. And if you can't get enough, Godzilla vs. Kong will be out next year. And that was filmed on the Gold Coast. Oh, so much Godzilla, so little time. Thank you, Nelson. <laughs>